As if we haven't had enough of this music. It's played in the last two areas. My gosh, that's why I was saying that in, at the beginning that this music plays way too much. Anyway, hello, Luigi Noids. This is Luigi X Rules playing Mario and Luigi Bowser's Inside Story plus Bowser Jr.'s Journey. In the last episode, we uh, explored an underground tunnel and uh, escaped Bowser. And in this episode, we're going to be exploring Toad Town Caves. Or... I really like this song. Also, I'm gonna unequip the budget charm just so you can see, well, something that's coming up. Also, we got a thrift charm, which is like the budget charm, except it's more for only one. I really like this song. This is Tyler Town song. It's really good. So you get really fast in the air, unlike in the original. You can press A or B to make it go by faster, but instead just boom. Alright. And now, we're up here and... Hey look, there's a giant block. Oh, that's a lot of stuff coming out of it. Hey! 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 You want hit that big block uh, that was just that was just floating around about around here head you did I saw you see what you did there used to be a right lot of shell stuffed into that block their block eh and yeah I still can't believe you not done it you knocked them out see that out there boils lots of shell blocks all over the mushroom kingdom hey eh? and you twits ain't got a clue as to the right uh, right and proper owners of them shells do ya give them here Give him here! Give him here! Shut it! Shut it! We ain't gonna be petty and ask for them back, eh? Uh... And now that I look at you, I'm impressed with the stash. You lot... Have you ever won a shell? See, the thing about shells, they're right heavy, eh? They're, you know, dense. Really, really dense. Get me? Uh... How's about you wipe that cheeky look off your mug, eh? Guess there's nothing for it. Only one real option here, hey? You uh, get to play a game. The weight of the shell be mighty, but right go, yes too. And if you uh, win the game, that weight goes away, hey? Hey! 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 Oh, me, looky here. It be one of the blocks you scattered. Now, hit it right quick. Uh, looks like that's our only option. Oh, guess on Mario. I hit we we go. Go, that suits you rather well, don't it? Right, simple rules, hey. Dash out here and hit us with your shell. Easy peasy. Oh, can't move with that heavy old shell on you. Heh, heh. Hmm. Alright, stop talking. Press B. Oh, nimble little zipper, ain't you? Right, you lot think you can... You lot think you can give me a whack? We smack! Then go ahead and try, hey? I'm quick as a wink. Think you can get me? Go, 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 go! Oh, me, hey! Hey! You lot mean business. Now, try a little of this. Go oh, on, it's like double the trouble, hey! Hey! Gotta hit both. In case that wasn't obvious. 
You oughta the real deal. That shell weight ain't nothing. Been a while since I met me a shell worthy sort. Good on ya. You got the raw, raw skills to become masters of the show. If you see a shell block, get a whack for me, hey? And whack this too. Hey! 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 An attack beast block. Ooh, I wonder where the other nine are. Take these with you. Just kidding. You get all of them at once. All of them have been found. Not a new bros attack. And toad pieces instead. It's Yoohoo Cannon. You can now use Yoohoo Cannons. What's up? Wanna watch a demo? No. I'm sure you all will find some use for him, hey? I don't think about carrying that heavy shell for life. Thinking like that can put the right skin to amateurs, hey? What's that? You want to know how to take the shell off? You don't want to take it off. Already. Well, my money says a jump might knock that shell off. You lot, can you jump with that shell on your back? Yep. Why'd you go and do that, hey? Ah, oh, well. Anyway, not right nice, in it? Whenever you, you uh, get to wearing, wanting to wear a shell, you just hit a shell block. Well, I'm off, and the clouds reappeared. Me too. See ya! And she was added to the guide, which is probably just what they said right there. Down is also pretty quick. Too, because you just wee all the way home. Going back down over here. Ah, I don't want to go back into the caves. Got some new enemies because of this new area. Watch out, pay attention to what direction we're going in. And also, watch out for this. Oops, I missed. Alright, so, we got a new bros attack, and you know, I've been thinking, maybe we should use bros attacks more. So, let's see, how much does the new one cost? Are you kidding? So, the jump helmet is almost to double the original. The Yoohoo Cannon is actually double the original! The original Yoohoo Cannon costs 7, and this one costs 14. Just stop with that, Nintendo. Stop doing that! Also, we saw both of the news' attacks. Not that bad. Not hard to dodge if I wouldn't have just left it. But... Why do they keep on doing that? But, newses have a little catch to them that we'll be seeing. They are level 12, by the way. And they can be made busy. They do have drops, of course. Their normal drop is the Super Mushroom. And... They can call more! And that's why I dislike the news. They can constantly call more, and then the battles will drag on for super duper long. In fact, so long that I'm just going to cut out the rest of it. Because we've seen everything they can do. Well, almost everything. Like, watch, there's only one. Then you call another one. And they can also change, is the other thing they can do. And oftentimes, the other one that they call will call another one. Also, this counts as the red news' attacks. Sometimes they'll blow tusks of air. To stay up. And they're calling another one! Oh my gosh! This is gonna take forever! I might get be getting a little loud, but this is the first battle! And it's already taking forever! I think they expect you to use bros attacks, but it's like, ah. Uh, with all the nerfingness they did with them, it's so. Hard, man. Also, I guess we can see what that did. It decreased the power of the fire flower. Huh. Oh, okay, sure, why not? Or it decreased the cost of the fire flower.
and watch. Okay, good. If I remember to, I'm gonna put on screen how many minutes that fight took. The only good thing is that they give out an okay amount of experience. It's not worth it. Newses take way too long for their effort. Also, something I wanted to show is that the Thrift Charm, it is a random one each time the turn comes around. It's not if you go out and then back in there that it changes. Look at that, you can finally cost what it originally costs. And they do have rare drops, which is the Super Secret Jar. Alright, let's go over here. Into this room. Hey, look, there's Bowser. Bowser, right? Wow, I knew it just inside his body. Weird. I knew what happened that made him fade. No trespassing, no trespassing, leave immediately. No trespassing, no trespassing, leave immediately. Uh oh. Oh, I mean, we left the. Get out go! I mean, we left immediately. Security system, huh? If we try to go through there, we'll get toasted at Bowser. We'd better go see if we can find a different route. Alright, so we'll just go up here and see that there's actually another new enemy. There's two of it, so they can do this attack. Watch out, they can poison. This is... These guys are kind of hard. Because they inflict poison and sometimes their jump attack is hard to dodge. Poison. Oh, I thought it took effect every time. Also, they they make the animation like they're um, low on HP whenever they're poisoned. I think poison is a new status effect. It's a lot like burn, except you do not lose the attack turn. Take that. Sometimes that can be really hard if it's like that. If they're both attacking you. I guess I never looked at the levels. As you can see, it do 5 damage, which isn't that bad. Level 13! Huh. Guess we're a bit underleveled then. Luckily, the Fall Flants cannot call other Fall Flants. You can use a refreshing herb at any time to cure poison, but eh, not that big of a deal. Oh, and they can be made dizzy, of course. And they can cure from dizzy immediately. You have to pay attention to which direction they're looking. They look up when they're going for Mario. And both of them level up! Now we're on even ground. Apparently we were a bit underleveled, huh? I have to do some grinding. Unsurprisingly, power is what they want to stop with. And, uh, I expected HP. Oh, power again. Yeah! Power! More power! I don't know what that's from, I just like saying it like that. In fact, it might not even be from anything, but Super Nut and, ooh, Refreshing Herbs. That's a useful item for the area where Like, see that, though? That is a pattern where I don't think it, would, it was possible for me to avoid that. Maybe, but I'm doubtful. Also, Siphon Gloves do change with level, like, with power, I think that might have been something they added in one of the newer versions, but I'm not sure. 
However, if they look down like that, then they're going after Luigi. Super Syrup Jar. Ooh, a nice metal bridge. I like the sound effect of walking on the metal. Alright, and... Hey, one of the shell blocks. Convenient that we went there first, right? Whoa! Hey, Mario Bros! I came to see what was up with the security system, but... I got lost, and I couldn't get this bridge working to go back. It's easy, usually. To rotate the bridge, you just hit the lever. They lost my lever whacking wrench, so I can't do anything. Ah, uh, what's it do? Nothing. You just say you couldn't. Uh, do not hit it in the middle. Hit it on one of the sides, and... You can move it. And then, over here, you... There's a specific pattern. You want to leave the second one alone. Hit this one. And then hit this one. And also, you know how you jump when you exit the thing? Oh. Okay, never mind. And the original, you could hit the blocks with that. Including that. So that's... One of the mushrooms are lit up. And there's three of them. I'm gonna go on this pathway over here. Find this creature. Of course, it's not guaranteed that they're gonna call him, but it happens a lot for some reason. Up here, you'll find another shell block, so might as well hit that. Hit this block over here to make a, another mushroom light light up. I think we can probably hit it from down there, but no, it's just a layer in. And super nut. So, up here we have some super syrup jars, and over here we have more uh, stupid newses. Alright, I guess we can show off what the Yoohoo cannon does. You gotta pay attention to which one they are. There are certain patterns, I like to call this one stripes. If I just, I memorize the patterns, and I have names for all the patterns. Again, I call that one Stripes. Does charge that quite a bit, but... Mm. Now, before I forget, I'm going to... re-equip that budget charm that I got. Alright. So that's all for this area. Now we can go on to the next screen. Find a block, so... Looks like we need the shell block. From this room. Alright, let's go over here. Get the shell boy. Just kind of quietly go over here and whack. That'll bring that back. And now, we need to go down there using those platforms. What you do now is you gotta hit all of these switches. Alright. I'm more secure when I can move freely like that. Alright. Now, with all three of the mushrooms lit up, we can go through the door. I wonder if the toad says anything different now that we've opened the door. Mm -hmm. Man, this area is so glum. This should be easy to rotate the light. Uh, it I already did that. Alright, let's go in here. Save block, okay. I know this is also a brut, but once again, the video is a lot longer than I would like it to be. Here, I'll, if I remember, I'll try to include how much of the video was me fighting newses about. But anyway. That'll be it for this episode, guys. In the next episode, we will be continuing to explore Toad Town Caves and continuing to listen to this music for the fifth time or something. Until next time, goodbye.